Macbeth, Daniel Hogan, and Tony Bismarck are stuck living in their truck in the East 3rd and Ingra homeless camp in downtown Anchorage. The area is also known as Tent City. And while times are hard, Hogan and Bismarck say there's one thing keeping them hopeful, meals provided by an Anchorage Good Samaritan. Most days after he gets off work, this man brings food and water to an Anchorage couple in need. His name is Charles Myers, a Kenai native. He's helping neighbors from the same area, Daniel Hogan and Tony Bismarck, who say they got stuck in Anchorage when their truck broke down. Myers says he first learned about the couple when he saw a story about them living at the homeless camp at 3rd and Ingra. He wanted to do something, remembering fondly of a time when the Kenai community helped him get back on his feet. They really need to help him. He can't leave her at the camp by herself because it's too dangerous. The couple has been staying at the camp for roughly three months. They've struggled to leave, especially with Bismarck requiring a wheelchair to get around. But Meyer's work has been making a difference not only for the couple, but for their best friend too. He's dropped off three weeks worth of food to Hogan and Bismarck and includes food for their seven-year-old dog, Charlie. Man, that, that helps out a lot. That cuts out some of the stress right there. Because yeah, that, that, I'm worried about how I'm going to feed him and begging out here on the street. The couple say they had hopes of working for a food delivery service to make some money, but when the transmission in their truck went out, they got stuck and have been sleeping in the front seats of that vehicle ever since. Whenever I make money, I have to do it day by day. And being out here, this is like the, I'm like Daniel in the lion's den. This man is all out drugs here. You can pull up, honk a horn, you can get anything you want. That's crazy. Never seen nothing like it. The couple was involved in a shooting at the camp, a bullet, Hogan says, even grazing him, in the incident leading to more mental health stressors. Bismarck now taking multiple medications in the aftermath of the traumatic experience. Myers stopping by every so often to check in on them both. Make sure they're okay, they're safe, and nobody's messing with them, because I know it's very dangerous in this camp. Worried not only for their safety. That somebody will try to come hit them up and rob the stuff but hopeful that better times are ahead. As for the couple, they want to be out of the homeless camp as soon as possible. Hogan says he has spent all of his money on his vehicle, but says that as soon as they have a working vehicle, they will be out of Tent City. Beth? Anchorage.